Hey everybody, Diana here. View from the table with Diana Miller. And I, hey Lainey Lee. I also have Lainey here. And she loves to see herself. Lainey Lee, can you say who's that? Say who's that, Lainey Lee? Who's that? So, this is what we have. Not a lot of time, right? What do I say all the time? The hardest ingredient to find is time. So, I wanted to come online. Uh, I want to come and show you this is what I'm dealing with in the kitchen right now, okay? I'm about to get ribs in the quick cooker on the table in just a matter of minutes, okay? So, I'm actually going to sit her down, and I'm actually going to cook um, some vegetables in the micro cooker. This is the two quart. This is what the lid looks like. This is a vented lid. Looks like a colander style lid. There are two size holes here. So say that you want to do chocolate covered peanuts, say that you want to melt some chocolate. Um, you see me do Rice Krispie treats, I could easily use the three quart and melt down the marshmallows and not do them on the stovetop, do them in the microwave. But if you're, say you're gonna do a vegetable, say you're gonna do some peas, some potatoes, you can just strain the water right off without even taking the lid off. How cool is that? Don't mess up your colander set, right? Um, so these are extremely versatile. They've been around a long time. They're very, very popular. One, two, and three quart. They nest together for storage. And um, I know you are looking at her right now, right? Yeah, I want you to. So, um, so I'm going to use the quick slice, do some zucchini and some squash in the two quart micro cooker. That's going to be going. The ribs are going to be going in the quick cooker. And uh, I'm going to be playing with my baby while all that happens. So I'm going to sit her down, turn the camera, and I want you to watch and see, right? All right. So. Kind of got a setup here. All right, Lainey Lee. I'll see you in a minute, okay? All right. So, did you know you can sear with the quick cooker? 16 functions. You can sear with it. So, I'm going to go ahead and turn the dial here to sear and press the start button, okay? I'm not afraid of a pressure cooker because we have our pressure indicator that will not let us open it. It's a safety feature. You cannot open this when the uh, pressure is up, is, is up. All right, so let's salt and pepper our ribs. Remember, I'm doing all this. I have a full-time job as a nurse practitioner. I love Pampered Chef. I feel like I do it full-time also because I want to, because it's my passion. And um, I'm doing it, right? I see Lainey crawling off over there. I can do this, and that's why I'm, I'm featuring the quick cooker. Also, the quick cooker, it is $109 this month. That is incredible, and we really just are proud of Pampered Chef for offering it to our customers. All right, so got this warming up. I'm going to quick slice um, my squash. I'm putting them in a little water. See, this is just going through it so quick and easy. Um, think about doing noodles. Think a lot of kids like, um, think about the summer coming and kids wanting to, you know, say you're at work and your kids are at home. So what can you do or what can they do in the kitchen without supervision? They're going to be calling, right? And um, don't run or have them run to the, um, don't have them run to the store. Or go through Dairy Queen, go through Hardy's. Not that I don't want Dairy Queen, but um, but just try to avoid fast food. So here's some fresh veggies and some water. I'm gonna put a little salt. Now our um, quick cooker. This is the Himalayan salt that we sell. All right, let's put the lid on it. Oh, I do want to add a little bacon for flavor. I'm gonna throw that in there. We're gonna put our lid. A lot of people like to do tea in this also. Um, and it locks in. There we go. But yeah, a lot of people do tea, and then when they strain the tea off, the tea bag is, you know, holds the tea bag in. So let's get this going. I'm doing about 10 minutes. Lainey Lee, can you come back? All right, we got it going. So um, let's take a look at the quick cooker here. I'm going to go check on Lainey. Let's get a little bit of oil. This is our garlic infused canola oil. All right, let's locate the baby. How are you, lady? Come on. Say, I'm back. I'm back. Okay. So my mama got me. 
And I'm not afraid to be around this quick cooker with my baby. You know why? This is not hot. This is absolutely not hot. I'm gonna add a little oil. So I can hold her at a safe distance, right? All right, so I'm going to, now you, oh, that smells so good. That garlic infused oil. We also sell this. And um, Lee cooked the other night and used it. I wish I could remember what he cooked and it was wonderful. And I told him, I said, I can taste that. Excuse me, these are our kitchen tongs. All right, you can hear the sizzle. Now, of course, I'm holding my baby back at a safe distance. I'm just going to go ahead and sear or brown my meat. I'm going to sit this on top, move this, put Lainey down now. Wash my hands. That's very important when you're dealing with meat. And it's Lainey. All right, very good. So, um, a little bit about quick cooker, very safe. I'm going to pull the camera so you can see it. Isn't it cool that you can do this? Because think about if you're doing chili, you can brown your hamburger meat. If, or you can brown your turkey. Um, if you're doing spaghetti, brown it. And you're not messing up a pot. If you're, I've done spaghetti. Add a little water. Add um, some spaghetti sauce. And um, add a little water, add a little spaghetti sauce, and shut the lid, and forget it. It's that quick. And simple, actually. Um, I have done chicken and rice. And when I do chicken and rice, um, I cook my chicken. I go ahead and I braise, or I, I sear my chicken. And then um, I add cream and mushroom, I add water. This is as if I was doing a um, chicken and rice casserole. I put the lid on it, and maybe, I think I cook it about 12 minutes, and it is great. You can ask my dad. If you know my dad, sometimes I'll take them chicken and rice down to their store. So, really good. So, we've got this searing, and actually, um, it's almost done. I'm going to grab some barbecue sauce, okay? Hold tight. Okay, I'm back. So, I want to share this with you. This is the famous Southern, uh, Southern Soul barbecue restaurant which we visited last weekend in St. Simon and so we brought back a bottle so I'm going to just throw it in I'm going to put the lid on it I'm going to set it and forget it right um every time I get off I, I remember something that I wanted to have told you um again super proud of our company the consulting kit this month we can't believe it is um $109 you get the quick cooker, you get the garlic press, which we use all the time. You get, you possibly get the tongs. I've got to look and refresh my memory. The silicone prep, um, the silicone cutting mat, which I adore. Um, so it is incredible. You're going to see me use a quick cooker all the time. We have a ton of accessories with it. We have steaming racks. We have another pot that you can cook. And say I've wanted to do rice or something. Or say if I'm doing a meat and I wanted to do... Um, beans, we can do that too. So I'm gonna add, I should have my eyes on my baby. Remember, that's what I'm trying to do here. Gonna add a little water. All right, so my measure all here. I'm just gonna add a little bit of sauce. Not sure how thick this sauce is. All right, so just got a little bit. Let's see, three quarters of a cup. Remember, I'm a working mom. I am a full-time nurse practitioner, a full-time mom, and I can get this done in just a matter of minutes, okay? Chef's tongs again. You don't have to, uh, there's no button. So I've get, given them a little sear. And they're good and brown. They've got a crust on them. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. I'm gonna put the lid on it, right? My camera wants, my phone wants you to see me putting the lid on. There we go. So, here it is. There we go. Gives me a chime. I am going to turn the indicator here to pork. And I'm going to hit play. 
and that's it. It is telling me, actually it's not telling me how much time, I will update you, but um, I'd imagine something like this will cook in about no more than 15 minutes. These are country style ribs, and um, you see that I'm close to it. I'm not afraid of this pressure cooker we, uh, or a quick cooker. The pressure is not built up yet because this is my indicator. I know it hasn't. Not afraid of my workforce in the kitchen. This is a tool I use often. Our safety mechanisms keep me safe, keep my family safe if I'm having to hold Laney. So, um, yeah, I'll post pictures. Bye.